Hey you guys, I'm back again with another mask review. These are, I'm just banging them out to let you guys know what I think of them because I'm trying to finish them off and try new stuff. So with that said, um, Peter Thomas Roth Pumpkin Enzyme Mask. This has been in my empties in the past in the tube version. And this is the very big daddy full size. Um, you guys this is one of my favorite masks oh, it no no like seriously it smells like pumpkin pie it smells like pumpkin pie I have gone through numerous of tubes of these in the smaller version this is the big daddy size so this is the five fluid ounce but they have um in kits okay of like different the different types in the jars they have one of a variety with the pumpkin included the pumpkin enzyme and they're like one ounce tubes i've gone through tons of those they've been in my empties if you've been here for long enough you would see them in my empties from time to time now, I ended up picking up the Big Daddy size because this was in a gift set somewhere on Sephora. I can't remember, maybe last year. Um, and it's a three-in-one, okay? Let me bring this up and see if I can. Peter Thomas Roth is one of my favorite skincare brands in general. Um, I've never had an issue with their stuff. It retails, the Daddy Big Daddy size retails for $60.00. But you can get the multiple uh, one ounces in a pack for like 40, 30 or 40 bucks, something like that. Um, and this is supposed to help with pores, dullness, uneven texture. There is granulated, I don't know if it's granulated sugar or granulated, let me see here. It might be granulated sugar because it's got like a... What's the word I'm looking for? It's got a like a sand texture to it for the exfoliating part. Um, no, where did it go? Oh, here we go. Uh, glycerin, pumpkin fruit filtrate, absorbing acid. Uh, Okay, aluminum oxide crystals provide effective physical exfoliation to polished skin, helping to rejuvenate an appearance of lackluster com complexion. And then it's got um, alpha hydroxy acids as well. So again, you know, I mean, I've been on this train telling you guys about AHA masks. And it's because I like the AHA masks. I like the AHA in a mask opposed to a face cream. Um... You don't need an exfoli chemical exfoliant every day in a serum or a face cream. So for this, it's perfect. It's got your physical exfoliant. It's got a little bit of your alpha hydroxy acid exfoliant for chemical exfoliation. And then your pumpkin enzymes is just helping to smooth the skin surface um, while smelling completely freaking delicious, let me tell you. Um, if you're ever in a Sephora, you need to go and smell this. That's all I'm going to say. Even if you don't pick it up, just go and smell it. Please. It smells like a pumpkin pie. Even a pumpkin spice latte. But I think more like a pumpkin pie. Fabulous. It works. It works. I apply this all over my face. Let it sit for five, maybe ten minutes. Then I use warm water and I, you know, massage gently the granules and I wash it away and my skin looks fantastic. So, you know, um, this says to leave on for three to seven minutes, uh, about two times a week. I don't really need it two times a week because I don't wear too much makeup to begin with. So, you know, I maybe use this every other week because I'm rotating through masks. But if you have limited masks, you can definitely use this at least once a week and you should be fine. You guys fantastic product i love it five ounces 60 bucks not bad um like the peter thomas or sorry the ole henriksen is three ounces 
and it's $41. So, I mean, for $20, for $20 more, $20 more, you get two extra ounces, which is a pretty good deal, I would think, um, for this one. This line comes with different ones. Like, there's the uh, cucumber one, which I like. Um, there's the... They used to have the marine one. I don't know if they do anymore. Um, or maybe it comes in a set. Yeah, it comes in a set. Um, the marine one, the gold one, the cucumber one, and the pumpkin one all come in a set for 58 bucks. So you can try all multiple Peter Thomas Roth masks for $58, which is cheaper than buying a full size of this. And I think those ones, I think, are like a couple, they're a couple ounces each. Let me see here. Uh... Oh, they're 1.7 ounces each. So they're 50 mils each jar. Um, so if you don't want the big daddy one and you want to get the smaller like mama size, you can get four in different flavors and try them all on uh, Sephora.com. So um, I've tried them all. So I already know. <laughs> um, this is my favorite one. This one and the cucumber one is my favorite. I don't have the cucumber one anymore. I finished it off. And um, I like to keep the cucumber one in the fridge and then wear it like at night. It's so nice and soothing on the skin, especially if you have sunburn or um, irritation. It really helps like the cucumber one is just fantastic. But this one is just as good. It helps to keep your skin texture down and glowy. And I really do think that if you're interested in a mask that is not too harsh, like I would say this is super harsh, the the um, Drunk Elephant Sukari Baby Facial. Um, this one is kind of like between these two, like they're the kind of, they run parallel. This one doesn't have granules in it. It's very smooth texture clay. This one has the granules, but um, it smells divine and it smells like a dessert. So it's really your preference. The granules are very fine, so they're not too damaging on the skin. They just give you a, excuse me, a gentle exfoliation on the surface of your skin. Whereas the um, AHAs, they definitely give you a more deeper chemical exfoliant on, underneath the layers of your skin. So that's the difference. This is more of a dual um, in the sense of a dual exfoliation, whereas, um, these two here have more of just a chemical exfoliation going on. Love it. This lasts a lifetime. I can't say better things about it. I've enjoyed it. I just love smelling like a pumpkin pie, especially in the fall when it's that season. Like who doesn't want to smell like a pumpkin spice pie? Like, come on. If you don't like pumpkin spice, get out of here. There's something wrong with you. Anyways, I digress. This stuff is the bomb. Love it. I will repurchase when I run out of this. I am finishing a tube up as we speak because I have a tube of a one ounce tube of this still that I'm going through. Um, and then I'm opening up this big bad boy. But it is fantastic. I love it. It does work. And I've never had an issue with it. Um, again, I only use this at nighttime and I only use it for between five to 10 minutes. And then in the morning I will apply SPF because anytime you use chemical exfoliation the night before, you need to apply SPF in the morning. It is a must. Don't say I didn't warn you. Thank you guys for joining me with my review. I appreciate it. Don't forget to like the video. Don't forget, subscribe if you're not. I have more videos coming up you guys, so stay tuned. Let me know down below. What face masks have you been loving? I'm curious. Do I need to be trying out more? Let me know. What have you been liking? I want to know so I can start venturing off myself. Bye, guys.